Hi, this is Mark Witten, co-creator of Bloody Disgusting's The Hotel, and your lobby boy. For early access to ad-free episodes, monthly bonus episodes, and postcards, access to our behind-the-scenes podcast, We Made the Hotel, and to get your name in our guest book, join us on Patreon at patreon.com slash the hotel. Thanks for listening. I'm here to file my report. Are you ready to hear me? I will tell you everything I remember. Everything I can. It's all slipping away now. But I'll try. The manager is too invested in plucking the humanity away from my guests. She sets elaborate traps and spends too much time talking during check-ins. I like to let the hotel do its business quickly and unimpeded. She clings too much to the fiction around her. I was going to recommend replacement. I don't think whimsy has any place in what we do. But her methods yield good results. The guests sit with horror long before they die. However, if you wish... We can replace her for someone who has a simpler view of the work. Very well. The lobby boy sickens me. They all do. He is callow and simple. He does as he's instructed with the work ethic of an insect. I still don't know if they're a construct like the hotel or if they've been enlisted as I have. There's rarely any difference in the lobby boys. I don't know what kind of report you want for them. He builds the rooms and escorts the guests. Frankly, I think we can operate just fine without him. As you wish. I inspected every form the hotel took. Each one was a perfect replication across the spectrum. If I still felt anything... I would have detected the faint sense of eerie dread that comes with visiting a hotel. It was never too much, never too subtle. If there is a machine at play, it's calibrated perfectly for each guest. If it's something else, it's tuned into the psyche of the guests and staff and reacts to them accordingly. As ever... I have no complaints or suggestions for the structure. I have no agency or control of it. I assume you do, or it does as designed by you. I have given you my recommendations for the staff. Yes, there is. It's not relevant to my report, so I didn't presume to waste your time. There was another in the hotel. Everywhere I shifted, I saw him. He wasn't one of the many manager or lobby boys. He wasn't a guest, either. He... He knew me, and I knew him. He didn't look familiar to me, though I did recognize him. In every hotel he watched me. He followed me, and I felt his hateful intent. He's cruel. Who is he? (laughs) No, I don't. I didn't get the chance before I was pulled away to you. Is he a new staff member? Is he... Does he represent you? Am I being audited? No, I only asked because you wanted a full report. Of course not. 
I understand what this place is. If he's designed for me specifically, then... No, I ask for no special treatment. I only want to do my job thoroughly, and if... I don't expect anything. Replacement? Why? Have I not done everything? If he is my replacement, then just tell me how I can... That's not what I said. I only meant if I'm to be released from the company. If I need to groom a new owner to oversee the transition, I can begin right away. Please. Please, no. I want to stay. I want to stay. I want to stay. I want to stay. The Hotel was created and produced by Travis McMaster and Mark Witten. Starring Kelly Ninaltowski as the manager. Mark Witten as the lobby boy. Graham Rowett as the owner. And Krista Lewis. Music by Lauren Picorni, West Rodri, and special guest composer Zach Tatum Drake. 